At first glance, I looked at this chest of drawers and thought to myself, it looks pretty good and could be an excellent concept for my room to create more storage for my clothes. The color really stands out and could help me organize the clutter in my closet. But I'm here to tell you that looks can be deceiving. There's one major problem I noticed with this chest of drawers and I'll go more into depth in this review. If you shop at IKEA, make sure you click on the subscribe button and the bell so you don't miss any of our furniture review videos. First, the overall structure is really sturdy. It comes with six short leveling legs, so if your floor is uneven, you have some wiggle room to make the chest of drawers level. This is an important feature as it's really heavy and you want to reduce the chance of it falling over. IKEA added two pieces of hardware that are used to secure it to the wall. Make sure that you're using the right screws as walls come with different materials. Fingerprints and smudges show a bit, but the paper foil covering the particle board is easy to clean with a damp paper towel or cloth. A cool feature of this chest of drawers is that it comes with the rail for clothes. You have enough room to fit about 10 to 15 shirts on hangers. The rail is also really sturdy, so this part of the wardrobe shouldn't fall apart. A little bit of foreshadowing there, because my biggest problem with this chest of drawers was actually the five drawers. Let's start with the build. Putting these drawers together was really irritating, as some pieces wouldn't fit well with each other. After struggling with building the perimeter of the drawer, you get these plastic clips that are supposed to hold the structure together. These clips are really difficult to put in, and sometimes didn't even want to snap into place. This whole concept of engineering will make these drawers fall apart eventually, even if you got all the clips in properly. The process of opening and closing the drawers is somewhat smooth, but they wobble from side to side greatly. Feels like the whole drawer can fall out at any time. It provides you with a decent amount of storage, but the overall structure of the drawers feel cheap. It took us roughly an hour and a half to finish the whole assembly, and you'll need to transport three different packages to complete this build. Two are small, and one may cause problems if you're trying to transport it in a small car. If you're interested in this chest of drawers, you can purchase it for $279 Canadian or $199 American. So due to the quality of the drawers, we wouldn't recommend buying this IKEA product. Smash that like button if you enjoyed the video, and screw that subscribe button if you want to see more furniture review videos.